The star remains black well projected to drive $500 billion in cumulative revenue by 2026. The real bombshell was partnerships with the U.S. Department of Energy, the Solstice Supercomputer at Argonne, with 100,000 Blackwell GP us for agenic AI and scientific discovery, and the Equinox cluster adding 10,000 more, pushing over 2,200 exaflops of peak compute. This is computing at civilization scale. Then the lineup, DGX Spark, desktop scale, with about one peta flop. Powered by Grace Blackwell, Bluefield 4 DPU with 64 cores for network compute acceleration. Connect X9 delivering 1.6 terabits per second, networking for AI factory throughput, and GeForce 5090 leaner, greener, and selling out. NVIDIA isn't just selling chips, it's defining the infrastructure for AI nations. Huang moved into partnerships and this is where it got real. Uber plans to scale to 100,000 fully driverless robo taxis by 2027. GM uses NVIDIA across manufacturing and in-car AI. Nokia launches a $1 billion program to build a US anchored 6G AI native network. Palantir, CrowdStrike, J and J, and many more are integrating CUDA, Omniverse, and Nematron. On the science side, NVQ Link connects GPUs to quantum processors. q to q offers quantum style speedups today, and Earth 2 accelerates climate simulations from hours to seconds. For robotics, Isaac GR00T Dreams generates synthetic training data, while the Newton engine simulates physical reality at ultra granular detail. AI, digital twins, and robotics are converging toward physical automation.